a reviewer. Hey, what's up, guys? I have a review here, and uh, <clears throat> this is not a review. This is a haul video. My first haul video. And now this is not the uh, the uh, 30th video celebration for the simple reason you'll be all like, oh no, he's reduced his 30th video celebration to a haul video. No, that's not what it is. It is the uh, I am removing all my older videos. I think it's going to be the lockdown friends forms that's going to be going missing. Uh, but yes, I'm here to talk to you about my haul because. I visited uh, the local nerd shop in my town, Forbidden Planet, um, and picked up a, a couple of things here. I'm just gonna get the contents of this bag off. Um, the Sergeant Forge. Oh no, this is Tartarus. I picked up the Tartarus Halo 3. Season 7 Tartarus figure. He has 28 moving parts. He is effing huge. And he's just Tartarus. Oh, yeah. And he's pretty heavy for a figure. And, uh. I also got. He's from the Halo. Tartarus is from the Halo 2 series. I also got. From the Halo Wars series. Sergeant Forge. Is rather cool. Comes for twelve ninety nine each. Comes with a magma shotgun. Tartarus comes with his custom gravity armor. So that's what I picked up. At I went to another shop called Argos, and I picked up power cool combiners Hoffer with Calibust. This is not mint in seal package. This is just me trying to hold the box back together. But th there's something interesting about the way these things are packaged. Um, you see, each th there's this clear tray and a light blue tray. Take this out, and the mini can actually have its own separate tray. Which is there. The mini has his own separate tray, just. Here we see the minicon has his own separate tray, and there's Calibust in his secret glory. And then there's the separate tray for Hoffa, who is a very nice little dude. Um, I'm just going to take a look at him here because. Now he's a fellow oh, little dude. His chest is like a really dark navy bluish colour. But yes, uh, they're packaged in a really unique way. There'll be some figure tacks, some of those cardboard twisties, but you can just pop out the minicon and him. And they're actually really easy to put back in. You just make them in the shape they were in the box and pop them in. Quite pop them to the back of their tray. The minicon's going really well back into the box. But I've gone through all the transformations without instructions. You don't even need the instructions in these guys. Um, I'm not going to do a full review. Of course, the full review will come sometime in the future. You choose. things I picked up today. Uh, so, there's more for you to request for the 30th video celebration. Um, one second. But yes, repackaging is kind of easy if you don't rip the card off like I did. But yeah, this is not gonna, there's not gonna be a full review until, uh, if if you request it. But yeah, requests. Op I'm open to requests. Um, if you don't request quickly enough, however, I will probably choose the 
I don't know that I will review it. Yes, uh, that's my grand haul. Uh, I hope to get some something uh, more with the remainder of the money I have left. So, uh, for all you guys, this is the epic review. And I'm sorry.